Hey everyone, my name is Quatsky and welcome back to another episode. Today we will be building a forklift, specifically one I'm building in my industrial survival base. Um, I thought I'd make a tutorial on it because it's a pretty neat piece of machinery. Um, yeah, so I guess let's get into it. Um, yeah, so the materials that you will need, seven orange concrete, uh, two pieces of orange wool, a couple orange banners, some orange carpet, um, gray carpet, string, item frames, some red beds, specifically red beds, a uh, dark oak sign, a lectern, glass furnace, some buttons, some stone slabs, some smooth stone slabs, some blocks of coal, or I guess you could use black concrete if you really wanted to, or um, black stone or something else that's dark like a wheel. Uh, deep slate tiles, a deep slate tile stair, polished deep slate stairs, a single polished deep slate slab, some polished deep slate walls, andesite walls, some nether brick fences, some iron bars, some iron trap doors, and a lightning rod. So, yeah. Yeah, so, start off with this, and we need all of these fun things. And there's yeah. Okay. So I'm going to want to place your coal blocks or tire blocks like this in a pattern and place your stone slabs down in the center and place so we're gonna make this the front. So we're gonna place two smooth stone slabs here. Then we're gonna place a orange concrete on the black tires and we're also going to place one in the center here and on the sides there we're then going to place two orange wool here we're then going to place a lectern um, facing out facing that way and we're also going to place a glass furnace facing outwards we're then going to just put the stone buttons on the tires and then put dark oak signs all along the edges like so. I'm gonna place your final sign right here and leave these two sp oh and leave those two spots empty. We're going to grab our deep slate tiles and we're also going to grab lightning rods, iron bars, polished deep slate walls, polished deep slate slabs, and polished deep slate stairs. So on the back here, you're going to want to place your deep slate tile slabs in um, this variation. You're going to want to take and place, or place your stair there. You're going to then want to take one of your nether brick fences and place it on the back, and then place a lightning rod on top. Then take your two andesite walls and put them back here with two iron bars on top. And then um, put your nether brick fences up like this in the back. You're going to want to take your polished deep slate walls, or sorry, stairs. Place them on the edges of the tire. And place, um, up, build up your walls all the way up to uh, this point here. To the third one, or sorry. Remove those two. Place an upper corner block like that so you get an upside down uh, stair. And another one on the side here. Oh. There. And then a slab in the middle like that. Then we're going to want to take your remaining polished deep slate walls from up here along with your remaining nether brick fences. Yeah. So it should look something like. And we're going to want to take the remaining items. So you want to take your six trap doors, your two red beds, two item frames, some string, gray carpet, and your orange carpets. For your orange carpets, you're going to want to place um, one on top of the orange wall and the other one on this side here. And then 
you want to want to place one on top of the lectern, but you can't place it in this general direction. So you're going to actually place it along the uh, nether brick fence. It's going to go place it there, but you won't be able to place it normally on top. You'll have to place it on the side. Then take your string and place it along this top level here. And then you're going to want to start to place your uh, carpets on top. Like so. Now you're going to want to take your iron trap doors and just extend them out. Like so. Then you have your... Uh, I personally like three, but you could also do two. I think three just looks better. And so with your item frames, you're going to want to place them like so behind the signs on the top block here. Then you're going to want to take your beds and place them right up um, in this part of the item from right here so they come through and right here. And then you're going to want to right click them. So one's like that, and the one on the left like that. Now there's one final step, which I could say is optional, but it's take your orange banners and break these two blocks here and place them like this and then you have some like mud flaps on the back and that that's the build so um i hope you enjoy i hope that you like this oh okay and so now um some other things you could do is if you don't like orange you could change it to any other color that has the concrete and wool colors same with the banners you can make new ones like that um and if you don't like having this uh, forklift part up high, you could place it at the bottom here and just replace these stairs down here and just replace this block with um, a wall. If you felt like you want it down, you could do that. So yeah, um, thank you for clicking on this video. Um, please like and subscribe and comment on what I should build next because I'm not too sure. But this is Quasi Guide. Uh, have a great day, guys.